the sounds that's really important and make it sounds in that uh, way. Yeah, yeah. Is, is that style of music, uh, you know, if if you were to play Swedish folk music, if that's a if that's a, a category, um, does it sort of sound like this, or is that a different feel altogether? Yeah, it's a different feel. It's more uh, the folk style is, uh, you know, based on uh, sometimes more like uh, native in- instruments. Mm, like, right. uh, okay. Uh, I-, I almost don't know the word for it, but, but violins and, uh, you sure. know, we got uh, uh, accordions and stuff. That That's original old Swedish folk right, music. Right, okay, okay. But uh, it's more singer-songwriting that, that's going on now in Sweden for maybe... 20 or 30 yeah, years. Okay. Th- that's very close to Americana. It, it, uh, it hit, uh, it's a hit off here as well in the late 60s. So, What kind of audience do you find resonates with, with the music? Uh, mostly older people, really. The ones that uh, experienced uh, Dylan's mm-hmm. uh, breakthrough. So we don't get many people under 35 or 40 Mm -hmm. years, Mm -hmm. but uh, it's like Dylan fans, you know, it's uh, so from 35, 40 years. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And 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 it's a, and it's a great, great audience because it, because they're listening a lot. But then of course, when we play pubs, uh, there would be a a bit younger audience. Right. Like it as well. Right. It's it's quite easy. It's not easy listening, but it is to it's easy to listen to it. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Do, do you have a a favorite venue that you like that that you like to play and perform this kind of music in? Uh, yeah, um, but they're different. We get different favorites. Uh, we got um, a great place here in uh, in Sweden on the west coast called. Uh, the station, it's a bit on the countryside uh, where we did our release gig and they're doing a Dylan Festival now when it's birthday. Uh-huh. It's to the 24th and 25th of May, we will return there and it will be a lot of bands. So it's a great venue. It's a small place. It own, it's a restaurant. It okay. only takes maybe 90 to 100 people. Oh, so wow. It's, All right. It's a re- very, very close and it's uh, the walls are filled with different um, Dylan posters. And oh, cool! Very okay. cozy and uh, yeah, yeah, it, it's really cool. But yeah. then we like to play theaters uh, as well. So, do you get to travel outside of the country with your music? Is it mostly Swedish exclusive to your country? No, we've only been to Sweden uh, this far uh, around Gothenburg on the. Uh-huh. West Coast, where we're based, and we did some gigs uh, in Stockholm and uh, in a state called Dalarna uh, as well. Yeah. So the next thing, I, I think we will maybe do it in uh, the rest of Sweden and perhaps in, uh, you know, Norway and Denmark is very close as yeah. well. And yeah. in Finland, they, they've been playing us sometimes, so I think we we'll stick to that yeah. at first. Yeah. 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 Well, well, hopefully but we, we want can to come over to you. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, hopefully we can we can help open the door with with this story and 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 let people uh, hear your music. It was fascinating. I loved listening to the tracks, and um, it's uh, it's always neat when something uh, in, in this country that that people uh, in some ways musically was very pivotal for for a lot of people uh, to hear it uh, done. A different way, but done very well, and give it a new interpretation. And and uh, so, yeah, I, I, it would be awesome to see you guys get a chance to to tour in the states. Yeah, thank you. It means a lot of them. Then, of course, we will play some other songs in, yeah, right? <laughs> that you will understand them. We know them. Like I said, our guitar player, he's got his in his mother's milk, Dylan. Yeah. Uh, so he, yeah. He, he can play it. Yeah. He sleeps. And. Uh, well, was it? Are you located in Bridgewater? I read about you that you you do you have a festival now. Uh, we actually do. Yeah, the, it's called the Red the Red Wing Roots Festival in July, and it's very much uh, Amer- wow. Americana. And um, 
roots and roots rock and you know a little bit of bluegrass and mostly kind of the fringe stuff but um a very eclectic uh interesting collection of of artists and performers a really nice three-day festival in july wow yeah that sounds great so yeah that'd be a lot great. of them uh, yeah uh, that kind of festivals in sweden as well yeah uh, it, it's it, it's fun but it, it, american is really huge here yeah, that's cool. Uh, well, it, it's, and, um, it's found a life of its own. Uh, it you know it was kind of a uh, an alternative music style, but for a certain uh, large portion of people now, it's it's the it's the main music. It's it's the closest to to the authentic. It gives the artist a chance to be real, and it gives the listener a chance to connect with the artist. And so, Americana has uh, really uh, be. be Begun to become a very popular format of music here. Yeah. So, if uh, people want to find your CD, listen to your music, get a chance to to know you guys better, where's the best way to? How's the best way to do that and reach out? Uh, it's it's either on Spotify if you want to listen to it, and if you want to know more about us, it's uh, I think the easiest. Thing for you is to get in on Bandcamp. Uh, okay. On uh, yeah, it's uh, varian dot bandcamp dot com if you want to listen and buy the CDs. Because I think our distributor, uh, well, I think it's the cheapest way to get the CD anyway uh, to get it shipped. And do you have a? We also a... put it out on vinyl. Okay. Oh, cool. Cool. That's right. I think I saw that in the press release. Um, do you also have a, web, a website? Yeah, uh, we have varian.net, but I, uh, I've written it in Swedish. Uh, I, I think about it. It's in, I haven't re- uh, written a lot uh, on it, so maybe I should take it in English. Instead. And we got this Facebook site for our Swedish fans. Oh, good. Okay. Visiting us there, so. Yeah, maybe I do Varian.net in English this yeah. week or something. Yeah, good. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, thanks, Raina. It was good talking to you. And um, I certainly wish you the best. And, and we'd love to get a chance to, to see you guys tour the United States. That would be awesome. Yeah, it would. Thanks a lot, Greg. Thanks again for tuning in to this episode of Americana Music Profiles. Find us on iTunes at Americana Music Profiles and on the Internet at AmericanaRhythm.com. 